start, 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 start. I just want you to picture yourself, yourself, yourself running, running race. A race. Get, get 500, 500 yards, yards to go. To the cross country trail ahead of you turns to grass. 400 yards. It's just you and your your competitor. The two of you. 300 yards. Faster now. Every muscle in your body is screaming at you to stop. 200 yards. You have no energy left. All, all of your muscles are used up, all, of, all that they have. Now, all that's driving you, all that's making you move faster and faster is your willpower, your will to get across that line for the guy who's right <coughs> next to you. Okay? But his mind is working just as hard as yours. His body is just as tired as yours. It's now just a, comp it's a, just a competition of mind, willpower. So will your willpower be stronger? So I'm Cameron, as I said. Uh, I'll be talking to you about lessons that I've learned uh, from running that I can apply to my life. And, oh yeah. So the first lesson is the lesson of persistence. In running, you're often faced with the choice to stop when it hurts or to keep going. Um, the next lesson is the lesson of mental toughness or willpower. It's just the will to get across the line fast. Um, and the next, the, the last lesson is focus. Being able to stay focused, put all your energy into doing one thing. Okay, so persistence. Um, like I said, there's a choice. You can keep going, you can stop. It's going to hurt. Running is a pain forward, but if you stop, you can't succeed. It's just a fact. Um, you have to keep going. You have to push through the pain. You have to get through the, tough, the toughest spot, part, part to get to get to that more more. That's more. that's, 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 that's that lies. The end, the end, and then you run. Now I find, I find that like, it's like a lot of the same. Body. same. It, that's it, it, that's, that's a lot of the same, same uh, uh, ideas. ideas. Life, life is easy. It's, easy. it's just, it's just that's, a, that's a sad, fact. sad fact, but it's true. It's true. You have to you figure, have to figure out, out a way to, to get past, get past each, each day. day. It's gonna it's gonna throw hard and hard at you, and you have and to you have persist. persist that. You can't just stop. Stop. You're not gonna be able to see what you're doing. So, so what I've found is that, that, that the the lesson the lesson that lesson that I'm learning is something that's not really through, like like all all school work school work things like that. It's got it's got me to the to the the at the end the end day feeling feeling good feeling like feeling like I've accomplished something because I was able to persist. And and I think life life was in general in general that way as well as well. So the next one is will power power and tough toughness. Running a running a race to the point the point that I just described to you where your body is has nothing left um, and the only thing pushing you is your mind your will to get across that line. Life is exactly the same way. You have to want you have to want to accomplish something to accomplish it. Um, and it's, it won't be, it won't necessarily be easy to accomplish it, um, but you, you still need to have that will, and also that mental toughness to stay on top of things, to not get beaten down by whatever life throws at you. Um, the third lesson and the last lesson is being able to stay focused, focused on what you're doing. Every day, life is going to throw something at you that isn't necessarily going to be enjoyable whether it's in work, school, family maybe. And you have to you have to you have to be ready for that that hardship to come because you know it's coming. And you have to when it comes grab it, focus all of your energy on getting over that one obstacle and you will be able to get to the other side, to the reward, to the end of whatever task you're doing. And also just applying these three things to every every aspect of your life will make life, it'll be easier to get over obstacles, through obstacles, when you focus on it. You have the will to, you have the will to get over it, and you have the persistence to keep going when it's tough. And also, after getting over that obstacle with those three attributes, you'll feel gratified, and satisfied, and just happy that You've done something. Um, um, you've done. You've done something hard. Both of you are seeing whatever you're going, going, whatever, whatever position, position, trying to get to. And and 
going, going getting, to that position, position or something, it's hard, it's hard. It's just so much, so much more magnifying than it would be if you just, just stop, stop, gave up, gave up, didn't persist, didn't persist. What, what didn't have to have left to get it together, didn't put so much in what you were doing. So, so, I'll take you back to that race you were running earlier. 200 years to go. Your mind, your mind, versus versus his mind. You're running faster, 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 faster than you were before. One hundred years to go. His will, his will breaks. Yours doesn't. Yours doesn't. The gap, the gap, one step, one step, two step, three step, three step, three step, four step, four steps. You cross, you cross the line, and you feel, you feel great, great. You've just, you've just, you're, you're, you've won that race, race because your will, your will was done the next, next to us. And now, and now you, you're satisfied, satisfied, gratified, gratified because you've done something, something. Amazing, amazing, something, something hard, hard, and that's why, that's why you feel satisfied. So, so. My message, my message is, is in my in my with these three attributes of your persistent systems and focus and focus. You'll be able, you'll be able to accomplish a lot, a lot more, a lot more than you previously.